Muslim disproves atheist about the problem of evil. Does God command it because it is good? Or is it good because God commands it? Now, if it's good because God commands it, you run into this arbitrariness problem, which is that God could command anything. With regards to the problem of evil argument, it's a totally false argument because it assumes that evil has some kind of ontological reality. Evil is real from the perspective of that it exists in our world, but ontologically it's based on the goodness and wisdom of the divine which undermines some key premises of that argument. Also from the perspective of suffering under a naturalistic account, well, what is suffering? Is this electrons whizzing around? Cold, blind, non-conscious, non-conscious, non-intentional mm. electrons whizzing around. So from a naturalistic paradigm, just like what Richard Dawkins says, and I have respect for him on this particular, on this particular matter because he's consistent. In his book he says, it's pitless indifference. No good, no evil. 